Jupe Vesterbro, Westbridge Christmas, episode 17, Heat EK, which I'm not sure there's a phrase in English that completely, uh, all caked up, let's go with that, thoughts. So, spoilers for these first 17 episodes, another episode I love, though I will criticize the offensive material, and let's dive right in. So yeah, th this is one of my favorites. I really, I don't know what it is. I just, I think it's the intensity with which Danny just really, really hates seeing them take bites out of these cookies that look like, you know, Anna takes one out of a co cookie that looks like Danny. Stuart takes one out of one that looks like himself. Just the it's not just that he's like uncomfortable he's acting like he's been physically attacked like I don't know if he thinks that like something that happens to the cookie is gonna happen to him also or just yeah I, it just it really cracks me up and he like he apparently does think it's hilarious that on it like Anna is, is basically acting like he's talking to a child, which in some ways he is, you know, maturity-wise he is. You know, he's like acting out, you know, the the thing, you know, he's, he's, he's trying to tell Danny, stop watching television and actually help around the house, you know. And Danny thinks it's hilarious up until the bite, and then he's like, you know, that's, that's women's work, you know, so just... Yeah, the fact that he like, dude, he's trying to tell you something. He's not exactly being subtle about it. And let's see. Yeah, so yeah, the episode very early brings up this thing of gender roles, which is a theme for the entire episode. You know, Danny doesn't want to help out Andy and ends up really hurting her feelings. You know, Stuart is, is yeah, doesn't want to help Greta. And the the um, yeah the the blues song is specifically because of the <clears throat> ah, what's the word um, specifically because people keep you know calling him a woman saying he's doing women's work and such and yeah I really like you know so Stuart comes in and you know. He says several swear words and then he says the word stairs. And Anna's like, you shouldn't use that language. It's like, they are called stairs, though. I use the right word. Just, yeah. And I like how they keep dancing around because we're expecting a flashback. We're expecting, you know, my dad used to say, but, you know, it keeps, you know, first Danny says, my dad used to say that. And then, then he says to Stuart, my dad, you, used to say, you know, and then Stuart's like, you're right, that's what my dad said too, and you know, for a second we think, oh, I guess we're not doing a flashback, but then he says, actually what he said was, and he does the t head tilt, just, that's, I, I, I think it's my favorite variation on that, although there is one coming up that is also very, very funny. And we get the ableist joke about, you know, he's like, oh, you know, if I had made this, uh, you know, this this cookie that's supposed to look like a person, it would have ended up handicapped. And, you know, he, he takes a bite and, and Danny's like, not the head. It just, <laughs> it's just, and, and, you know, Anna is confused and Stuart's also like, what what is he on about? Just, and then we get a transphobic joke about, you know, uh, Anna looking like a woman and, you know, back in the, the, yeah, that they, you know, they would, they would beat up their date to make sure it was a woman. Just, yeah, really, really messed up. And yeah, and, and yeah, so Stuart goes into the, the garage and, you know, says, you know, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay in on, on Christmas, which of course, you know, the, we know these are these are supposed to be terrorists, so they're you know this is what they've been building up towards. They don't want they they really badly want to carry out the attack. So you know Kefia says, but it's 
so pretty, and and Stewart says, so is my Johnson, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna take it out, and you know, in this really public place, again, and then we get this, like I think it's the most of all the different time, of all the different like memories he he, you know, um, he he talks about having. This is the one that's the wildest. So the the yeah he, he after that he says the reason I won't do that is because of the court order you know it they they went pretty easy on me considering how freaked out the bus full of hostages already was they never did find the dwarf good thing they didn't take a stool sample that was the most bizarre christening i've ever been to but the funeral was beautiful. Good thing they already had the, an appointment in the church. It's just like, what? Like, this is, you know, you could make a movie about this story. Like, holy crap, there's a lot there that's just, yeah. And let's see. Yeah, Randy shows up and... <laughs> You want a bite of my, you know, what do y'all call that Danish? I guess, yeah, the, you know, morning, yeah, you know, baked goods. No. <laughs> and then there's a joke that I just, it, I cannot translate, but, uh, di directly. I can explain it, though, in English, but the, the yeah, you know, Randy says, you know, we, we got a place, you know, and then she says, Ud a vil, a vil. Danny offers, Ua? Yes, a vil Ua. Which, it's because a vil sounds like out, out thereabouts. And a vil Ua is an actual place in, in Copenhagen, you know, so it's, I'm pretty sure it's in Copenhagen. It's, it's one of, you know. And I love the the joy with which she announces that it has a bike shed. Like, she sounds like she's talking about, you know, it has, it has a pool, it has a, you know, the, the, we'll be living in a skyscraper, so, you know, something amazing, you know, it's hotel uh, level, you know, quality. It's, it has a bike shed, you know, just like, her eyes light up, just, you know. And the, yeah, and, and, you know, yeah, he's, he's like being a jerk to her and, and she's about to take a bite uh, and he's like, oh, yeah, now you're going to take a bite. You're already leaving crumbs, but it's just baked good. Yeah, but it's the principle of the thing. <laughs> and just the way that she, the, the cry, the, <laughs> it's, it's so funny. I just, yeah, it's. Just yeah, and you know they they actually put the the that's part of the intro sequence to every episode is the the bit where where she's like crying in this very weird way. By the way, I also gotta say like they did a great job on the cookies, like the the yeah that really you can easily tell who's who. The the you know Stuart has the the sailor's hat, and I feel like they also made the the vest. And with Randy, you can see the the jacket thing she's got with the the yeah um, yeah and and you know Danny does feel bad and goes after Randy and yeah uh, Anna performs a really great blues song all about you know the the bittersweet you know experience of being a social worker. It's one of the best songs, and it's definitely the least offensive of the songs. It's probably the only one that isn't at... That's almost not at all offensive. And, you know, it does have the, the thing about the, um... Ah, you know, the, the joke about the, the, you know, plastic surgery it feels slightly misogynist. And, yeah, you know, now that we're nearing the end of the entire run, 
the the show tension is reaching its its peak. You know, this is the the biggest fight that the you know Gandhi has been upset with Danny before, but this is like this really really hit you know the let's see and. Uh, yeah, we, we don't see the payoff, but we do get, you know, there's going to be a conflict between Stuart and Greta. And the very ending sets up the conflict between Anne and Stuart. So, yeah, the... But the... Yeah, and, and the... Um, let's see... Yeah, um, Vivian is apparently now very horny. Which, you know, that is, like, some some women do get very, very horny on, um, you know, either at a certain point during their, their menstruation or, like, very soon after the, the menstruation. You know, and up until this point, they've been joking that she was menstruating and maybe this is right at, you know, this is very soon after she was, yeah, um... I, I don't necessarily it I, I will agree that it's kind of funny this thing of like she ends up having sex with the person who's the least like you know other than maybe Kefia of all the the and, and you know obviously Danny of all the men that that you know like I think even Igor is probably more like he he seems more like virile than than Anne, you know. Anne is the the least like hyper masculine, like impressive man that you know, and and he's the one who ends up having having sex with her. It is slightly creepy that when when you know that the the voice of Vivienne is the mother of Anna's Madison. And Anna is played by Anna's Madison, so the voice saying, you know, the the yeah, she's still saying "go away," but her tone is is more like seductive, and that's being said to to the actress's son. So that's that was a choice. Um, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, and and Stewart is paid by Kefia so that he'll let them operate the the hot dog stand on Christmas, and yeah, so he goes up and and hears the the from inside the the door, and the speaker comes on, and you know, Stewart realizes, you want me to stand here for the next twenty four hours, you know, as interrupting him again, and he's like. Okay, I'm sorry, but I'm taking a what was it, a cigar or something. Actually, I don't know what y'all call those. In Danish, it's sirut. It's not quite a cigar, but it's on the way to being a cigar. It's it's a it's a teenager cigar, you know, teenage teenaged cigar. And the, yeah, and you know, he's yeah. The speaker says, you know, tune back in tomorrow, and you know, Stuart interrupts him and says, shh, tune back in tomorrow. You said that already. <laughs> Just yeah, but but yeah, you know, very clearly building up to a series of of conflicts, uh, you know, between the the major characters to really get you know, it's supposed to be as like what's the word? It's um. It's supposed to feel like there's no way that this could be happily resolved before we reach the ending, you know. And yeah, this episode does quite a good job at that.